Acknowledge that the hypnotizing star in our sky that could be amazing is this one, Bug Smash or Scare Press. On the contrary, it's a red monster star. In a remote probability that you put it where the sun is, it would interface with the orbit of Jupiter. It's enormous, exceptionally whimsical, and going to detonate. It's not as clear as it seems. In the universe, these incredible events, like the most dreadfully huge starbursts, could shake all that we see and don't see. Things aren't always clear, anyway. Betelgeuse has been interpreted as a warning sign, a very red giant star that is many times more massive than our sun. Brian Cox and other space experts believe it could go supernova at any time. People are generally scared of what will occur, especially since the James Webb Space Telescope is utilizing extraordinary photos of the star. When exactly will Betelgeuse become a supernova, and how massive of an impact will it have on Earth? Let's figure it out. Locate the constellation Orion, a star that shines so brightly that even people from long ago have seen it. Betelgeuse's main character is situated on the eastern shoulder of the constellation. It is the second largest star in Orion, and its name comes from this feature, the beast's shoulder. It is potentially one of the most beautiful stars in the sky. On top of being particularly bright, the star is also an odd shade of red, which, as we'll see, suggests trouble. We've known about Betelgeuse for a long time. A Greek astronomer named Ptolemy also studied it. In the context of that time, the first thing people recognized about stars was their color. Ptolemy said that it was meant to wake up a small creature. Betelgeuse's orange variety intrigued researchers who have been studying it closely. Now, they have a decent idea of what makes it so unusually bright. One of its properties is that the star changes brightness a lot. With a magnitude variation of 0.6, Betelgeuse is a variable star, meaning its brightness fluctuates over time. However, specialists recently discovered new data. In 2019, Researchers first observed that Betelgeuse was behaving strangely. While it didn't completely stop shining, it had become significantly dimmer, shining at a magnitude of around 1.6. Researchers quickly began investigating why one of the top 10 brightest stars was changing in such an extraordinary manner. Experts have since made a terrifying statement based on their research. Betelgeuse has recently shown bizarre signs leading some to believe it could go supernova unexpectedly. Brian Cox, a well-known researcher and professor of particle physics at the University of Manchester, offered this explanation. He also writes popular science books and is the Royal Society's public engagement instructor for science. Cox says that Betelgeuse seems like a ticking time bomb. It could go off without advance notice. To compound the situation, the James Webb Space Telescope has provided massive amounts of evidence supporting this statement. Regardless of the peculiar signs that Scarab Juice, Betelgeuse, has given, which have caused difficulty in space study, researchers are still uncertain about when it will detonate. The fact that Betelgeuse is many times the mass of the sun is one explanation for this uncertainty. A star must be many times the sun's mass to be classified as a supernova. Things get even more interesting when considering the tools researchers have used to study Betelgeuse. For instance, the James Webb Space Telescope and the Laser Interferometer Gravitational Wave Observatory have been used to analyze space around Betelgeuse. However, what they found remains unclear. Betelgeuse was born on August 31st, a surprising amount of time ago. The alleged star of Betelgeuse has given unusual signs about its future. What did researchers discover? Strange light, waves emanating from the star, an extremely odd phenomenon. But that wasn't the only thing specialists observed. This leads us to the possibility that Betelgeuse is a star whose brightness fluctuates. It was reported that Betelgeuse dimmed at regular intervals and had dark spots similar to our sun. However, the conditions have changed. Now, it shifts from bright to dim twice as fast as it used to, another odd sign of Betelgeuse's strange behavior. Researchers noticed that the star's dimming cycle reached a very low point in February 2021, with a brightness of plus 1.61. This occurred shortly after the significant dimming event. 
Remember how the star appeared to dim dramatically in 2019? That event is known as the Great Dimming. It was the beginning of Betelgeuse's odd behavior, making many people worry that it was about to explode. Between 2019 and 2020, the dimming range was 1.2, with 2019 recording the most extreme dimming ever. Because of this dramatic dimming, specialists are certain that Betelgeuse will go supernova within the next 100,000 years. There's an interaction happening in the universe that is truly startling. Researchers initially adjusted their viewpoints after observing Betelgeuse's behavior, but then something unexpected happened. Betelgeuse became brighter again after the Great Dimming, transforming into something fundamentally more striking. Astrophysicist Andrea Dupree at the Smithsonian Center for Astrophysics, Harvard, says that the star is now 150% brighter than usual, making it the seventh brightest star in the sky at this moment. Researchers were terrified when they saw a red shimmer in the southern hemisphere. Even more interesting, this has led to various new theories about what caused the great dimming. First, it's essential to note that not all stars exhibit the red shimmer that Betelgeuse does. The red shimmer of Betelgeuse denotes a red supergiant star, the final phase of a star's life and death. This shimmer is caused by a surface temperature of around 3,500 Kelvin significantly lower than the sun's outer layer, which is 5,500 Kelvin. Since Betelgeuse is cooler than our sun, it produces less heat per unit of surface area, despite being more massive and on the verge of exploding. So what does the great dimming mean? Brian Cox asks. Does it imply that Betelgeuse is about to go supernova? The fact that Betelgeuse is a red supergiant already suggests that it is nearing the end of its life. A dying star typically fades over time, which is what researchers expect. Final thoughts. The recent abnormal behavior of Betelgeuse has made researchers even more concerned. As a result, many telescopes are now focused on studying the great dimming. Because of its unpredictable behavior, Betelgeuse has become one of the most closely observed stars in the universe. Scientists worldwide are racing to understand what is truly happening as the consequences of a supernova event would be significant, not just for astronomy, but for our entire understanding of stellar life cycles. Could Betelgeuse's explosion impact Earth? One of the biggest questions people ask is whether Betelgeuse going supernova would pose a threat to Earth. The short answer is no, at least not in a way that would directly harm life on our planet. Betelgeuse is approximately 642.5 light years away from Earth. While that is relatively close in cosmic terms, it is still far enough that the explosion would not cause direct harm, such as radiation exposure or gravitational effects. However, the event would be one of the most spectacular cosmic occurrences ever witnessed by humanity. When Betelgeuse finally explodes, the supernova will likely be as bright as a full moon and could even be visible during the daytime for weeks or months. It would outshine every star in the night sky before gradually fading over time. Although the explosion itself wouldn't impact Earth physically, it would provide scientists with an unprecedented opportunity to study a supernova event in real time. Given how rare and unpredictable these explosions are, witnessing one in our cosmic neighborhood would be a once-in-a-lifetime event for astronomers. What causes Betelgeuse's strange behavior? The unusual dimming and brightening cycles of Betelgeuse have puzzled scientists for years. However, researchers now have a few leading theories about why the star behaves so erratically. 1. Massive dust clouds One possibility is that Betelgeuse ejected a massive amount of material, forming a dust cloud that temporarily blocked some of its light from reaching Earth. This would explain the sudden dimming in 2019. Two. Surface activity and star spots. Just like our sun, Betelgeuse experiences convection currents and magnetic activity that cause fluctuations in brightness. Large star spots, cooler regions on the surface, could be responsible for its irregular dimming and brightening cycles. 3. Final stages before supernova. Some researchers speculate that Betelgeuse's behavior could indicate that it is entering the final stages before going supernova. 
However, predicting the exact timing of such an event remains extremely difficult. The role of the James Webb Space Telescope The James Webb Space Telescope, JWST, has played a crucial role in monitoring Betelgeuse. With its infrared imaging capabilities, JWST has been able to penetrate the surrounding dust clouds and capture detailed images of the star's outer layers. Recent observations suggest that Betelgeuse may have experienced a colossal surface mass ejection, something far more extreme than the solar flares we observe on the Sun. If this is the case, it could mean that the star is in the final stages of its life cycle, moving closer to an inevitable supernova. However, other studies indicate that Betelgeuse could remain stable for thousands of years before it finally explodes. This uncertainty is part of what makes it such a fascinating subject of study. What will happen when Betelgeuse goes supernova? When Betelgeuse finally explodes, the event will unfold in several stages. 1. The initial burst. The explosion will release an immense amount of energy likely producing a blinding flash that could be visible during the day. 2. Neutrino Emission Scientists predict that Earth-based neutrino detectors will receive an influx of particles hours before the visible explosion, serving as an early warning system. 3. Expanding Shockwave Over the following weeks, the explosion will continue to expand, sending a shockwave through space and leaving behind either a neutron star or a black hole depending on the final mass of Betelgeuse's core. 4. A new nebula. The remnants of Betelgeuse will eventually form a spectacular nebula, much like the Crab Nebula, which was created by a supernova observed in 1054 AD. Conclusion. The cosmic clock is ticking. While no one can say exactly when Betelgeuse will go supernova, we know that it will happen eventually, whether that's tomorrow, in a decade, or 100,000 years from now. Until then, Astronomers will continue to monitor the star closely, using advanced telescopes like JWST to gather data. Regardless of when it happens, the explosion of Betelgeuse will be one of the most extraordinary cosmic events witnessed by humanity, a brilliant reminder of the vast and dynamic nature of our universe. So, keep an eye on our eye and shoulder. One day, you might look up and see something truly spectacular the fiery farewell of one of the universe's most iconic stars. Things get truly interesting since specialists still don't have a significant comprehension of Betelgeuse. Researchers are now using the most cutting-edge instruments to focus on the intriguing events occurring around Betelgeuse. The James Webb Space Telescope has been one of the best tools currently used by researchers. Since its launch in 2021, the telescope has been in space assisting scientists in gathering critical data about Betelgeuse. New images of Betelgeuse's remarkable dimming, captured by this telescope, have revealed that the incident was caused by a light-colored surface mass ejection. A new analysis suggests that this mass ejection was 100 billion times greater than an ordinary coronal mass ejection. Additionally, the James Webb Space Telescope can examine things beyond human vision, such as light waves and frequencies. Thus, experts are excited about what the telescope will uncover next. Researchers have observed dust clouds forming on the surfaces of stars, appearing to leave into space. This phenomenon is puzzling, especially considering Betelgeuse's eventual fate. Scientists continue to monitor the star closely because they are uncertain when it will go supernova. Betelgeuse is believed to be many times more massive than the Sun and astronomers predict that the brilliant red star will shine for another decade. However, given the star's unusual behavior, it's difficult to say if this estimate will hold. Despite its significant dimming, experts don't believe Betelgeuse will explode soon. If Betelgeuse does go supernova, it will be the first supernova observed independently since Johannes Kepler recorded one in 1604. However, Researchers hope it doesn't happen soon, as they are still studying the star's extraordinary behavior. While it is certain that Betelgeuse will eventually explode, exactly when remains a mystery. Looking at the universe without predefined limits, Betelgeuse stands out as one of the most captivating and unpredictable stars in our sky.
Often referred to as Bug Juice, this red giant star, if placed where our sun is, would extend all the way to Jupiter's orbit. This extraordinarily massive and unstable star has an imminent impact on the universe. But the cosmos does not follow predictable rules. Shocking events, such as dreaded stellar outbursts, could dramatically alter our understanding of Betelgeuse. The star has exhibited remarkable signs of instability. Betelgeuse, a red giant several times the size of our sun, has captured the attention of cosmologists, including Brian Cox, who believes it could go supernova at any moment. The potential consequences of this event are a source of concern, particularly since the James Webb Space Telescope has captured disturbing images of the star. So, when exactly will Betelgeuse go supernova? And what effect will it have on Earth? Recently, Betelgeuse has dimmed significantly, shining at a magnitude of around 1.6. Researchers quickly began investigating this unusual behavior in one of the 10 brightest stars in the night sky. Their analysis led to a startling conclusion. Betelgeuse could go supernova at any moment. Brian Cox, a renowned physicist and professor of particle physics at the University of Manchester, has shared this concerning information. As a well-respected academic, author of popular science books, and host of science programs, Cox's insights hold significant weight. He has described Betelgeuse as a ticking time bomb, emphasizing that it could explode at any moment. The James Webb Space Telescope has provided extensive evidence supporting this claim, capturing stunning images that highlight the star's instability. Researchers have been particularly fascinated by Betelgeuse's peculiar patterns of light over extended periods. For years, scientists have noted its fluctuations in brightness. However, recent research suggests these changes are becoming more extreme. The star's rapid brightness shifts indicate it may be entering a critical phase of its life cycle. In 2019, during a significant dimming event, Betelgeuse's brightness dropped to an unprecedented low, causing alarm among astronomers. This event, known as the Great Dimming, led many to speculate that the star was approaching the end of its life. However, scientists have since discovered that Betelgeuse, while prone to dramatic shifts, is still behaving unpredictably. Observations now show that Betelgeuse is 150% more luminous than expected, making it the seventh brightest star in the night sky. This sudden increase in brightness has sparked debate among researchers. Some believe it may be a precursor to the star's eventual explosion, while others suggest environmental factors, such as dust, changes in surface temperature, or clouds, could be influencing its luminosity. The James Webb Space Telescope remains an essential tool in this investigation. With its advanced capabilities, it can detect light frequencies invisible to the human eye, offering deeper insights into the star's behavior. For example, the telescope has detected dust clouds on Betelgeuse's surface, resembling leaves floating in space. Despite Betelgeuse's inevitable fate, researchers remain captivated by its ongoing changes and want to gather as much data as possible. While scientists believe the star will remain bright for the next several years, predicting its final fate remains a complex challenge. If Betelgeuse does go supernova, it will be the first visible supernova to the naked eye since Kepler's supernova in 1604. The consequences of such a nearby supernova could be immense. Depending on its distance and energy release, it might impact Earth's atmosphere and potentially even life. For now, astronomers remain on high alert, continuing to study Betelgeuse's unpredictable and extraordinary behavior.